Okay, first step is you pull a piece of brochure paper out. Nice thick paper. Put it on the clipboard. Doesn't matter which side's up, they're both the same. And then you get solution A. And fill the squirter, put it in the little cup. Do the same for B. Oh, I like how he's putting the tops back on. Excellent. Keep that even. Okay. Now you're going to mix those together. And you're going to apply it to the paper. Oh, not that way though. You can use the dropper and the glass rod. Put the glass rod at the top of your paper and put your drops right along the lower edge of that glass rod. Okay, start with that amount. That's good, we can use the rest in a second. Now pull that glass rod down nice and slow, like there's a wave in front of it, and it spreads the solution nice and evenly on the paper. This is a particularly fine job. A lot of students get holes in it. If you do get a hole in it, you just go back over it. Okay, lift up the rod, let the wave go in front of it, now push the rod back up the other direction. Fill in that little hole you got right there. Good. Now you have it kind of thick at the top. See if you can capture that and pull that back down over the paper. You probably had enough to do two papers here. Nice and even. And if you see an area that's kind of thick on still, like along the right hand side, yeah, we're going to pull that the other direction. And done. The next step is going to be to move that into the drying room with the fan and the heater. And that will dry in about uh, 10 minutes and then it can be time to put the negative on and do your sun print.